Hey, what's going on, NFL fans, Atlanta Falcon fans? This your boy, Antoine Smithy Smith, Smithy Sports Machine. Y'all know I get down, man. Y'all know I do it. Press that subscribe button. Also, press that notification bell to get my videos as soon as I drop them. Press that like button, man, to help me get my recommendations up to get my videos through the YouTube universe. Very quick, man. A move we've anticipated for a while. Falcons have added another genius to the coaching staff, man. Uh, Jerry Gray has been hired on by the Atlanta Falcons. And shout out to my boy Alberto uh, for shooting me the message as soon as he got it. Uh, but this is the move we've all been waiting on because we thought he was going to be the new defensive coordinator, but they had something else in mind. See, they made a smart move because now you have two great defensive minds at two positions of need that you need to improve on. Uh, so when you look at it, and I'm putting the Falcons' uh, stats from last year, from the passing game up on the screen so y'all can see it. Uh, this is why they hired Jerry Gray. And what's crazy, he's another guy that used to be a defensive coordinator uh, in the NFL in Buffalo from 2001 to 2005. And peep this, in 2003 and 2004, his defense rate number two, both seasons in the league. So he knows exactly what he's doing. And these guys that worked together before, man, they're no strangers to each other at all. He has familiarity with, with Arthur Smith, especially in Tennessee. And if you haven't noticed, man, Jerry Gray has been in Tennessee, Houston, back in Tennessee again. So uh, that's his neck of the woods. Spent his last three seasons with Green Bay. And y'all know at Green Bay, they've always played against the pass very well with guys like Jair Alexander. And they had a decent pass rush. Um, but when you look at what he brings, man, he brings uh, – veteran leadership, and he was a very good player for the Rams, actually a first-round pick back in the day. Uh, so he's always had a high IQ for the game, and uh, Jerry Gray is probably the best hire, uh, one of the best hires uh, the Falcons had in a while in that defensive backfield. Now, I'm not going to discount Mark Wayne Manuel because still I think he got a raw deal. But Smith also worked up under Gray, in 2011, as a defensive quality control coach in Washington, uh, while he was, you know, a defensive uh, a coach in Washington, um, during his time with the Titans, they had the number one, number eight ranked defense in 2011, 2012. Titans ranked seventh in interception, tenth in sacks. And that's that word again, sacks. So you got two guys that can teach defense and improve this defense. Um, and this is what the Falcons are doing. As I've said, I think they should make building the defense their identity, but they're starting with coaching. And think about it. Last year, I always say, man, they had a lot of second string, third string practice squad players on the defensive side of the ball and still won seven games. Could have won more had the offense moved the ball a little bit better, but you get where I'm going with that. So they can only go up from here, right, with better coaches, Right? We will see. But uh, Jerry Gray, man, it was a great hire by the Falcons. And, man, I can't wait to see uh, which way this thing goes, man, to go with Ryan Nielsen, man. Um, I think the Falcons have hit a home run with this coaching thing. Now it's time to get the free agency. Now it's time to get to the draft. And this, too, uh, will probably determine what they will do in free agency and the draft now that they have, you know, the right coaches to coach this scheme. And uh, think about it. I think uh, Jerry Gray could help Ryan Nielsen, and Ryan Nielsen could help Jerry Gray to make this defense probably one of the best in the NFL. But we will see. Falcons hired Jerry Gray, man. Uh, and thank, thanks to Scott Bear, man. I use a little bit of his info, you know, to give y'all a little bit of, you know, what's going on. Not afraid to give them nobody no shout out if I use their stuff. I mean, hey, I got to get the content out there. But we knew Jerry Gray was coming. We just didn't know in what capacity. He's the associate head coach, assistant head coach, and a defensive uh, backs coach. So we'll see how it goes. And uh, y'all let me know what y'all think. Drop those comments. Let's debate. Let's have fun, man. Y'all know how we do it on the sports machine. This is your boy Antoine Smith. Smith signing off. I will holler at y'all later, man. Peace.